नमस्ते फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक टू द सारथी टेक्नोलॉजी इन दिस वीडियो वी विल लर्न हाउ टू क्रिएट टेबल विद एरे ओके सो दिस इज द प्रोजेक्ट दैट वी हैव क्रिएटेड इन द लास्ट वीडियो सो व्हाट वी नीड टू डू जस्ट रिमूव दिस ओके सो फ्रॉम हेयर टू ओके सो रिमूव दिस व्हाट वी हैव वी हैव कॉलम विथ ऑफ एरे एंड वन टेबल ऑब्जेक्ट एंड ऑल्सो वी हैव एडेड दिस टेबल इन द डॉक्यूमेंट सो वी विल फर्स्ट क्रिएट वन एरे फॉर टेबल हेडर सो स्ट्रिंग एरे टेबल हेडर एंड द फर्स्ट हेडर इज आइटम कॉमा कलर साइज ओके नाउ वी विल क्रिएट वन एरे फॉर आइटम्स so this array will be two dimensional array so item array just press enter here and here we will add item for first row so box its color is red its size is big comma for the second and same we can add as many as row we need to put in the table so our array is ready now first we need to add this header in the table and for that we can just use table oh first we need to create table object so accidentally i have removed that but we need to add so actually the table object is here so just cut this and paste here okay now table dot add cell new cell dot add and here table header put zero and semicolon just copy paste and one again paste and two okay so using this way we can add table header we can also create one for loop and then our work will become simple so for int equal to 0 int i okay so int i equal to 0 i is less than 5 i plus plus now again for the second we will create one another for loop for int j equal to 0 j is less than 
the column is 3 so less than 3 j plus plus so this one for the row and this one for the column so this for loop will run three times and in three times we will add first row again when this loop will run again we will add next three cells and again when this loop will run we will add next three cells okay so here we need to write only one line of code so table dot add cell new cell dot add item array and in the first we will put i and in the second we will put j and semicolon okay in the last we need to add this table in the documents which we have already added so just run and and here you can see pdf created now open and here you can see we created one table using array okay so this is enough for this video in the next video we will learn how to color table okay so color formatting we will learn in the next video meanwhile if you have any doubt then please write that in the comment box below please don't forget to subscribe and like thanks for watching see you in the next till then bye